here comes the money. You're now listening to the Gambling with Gold podcast with Jason Gold. Presented by Champions Round. Last game preview that we have for NFL Week 15 betting slate. We'll make it quick because this game is gross. The Rams plus seven at the Green Bay Packers. 65% of the bets and 73% of the money is coming in on the Rams. Baker Mayfield will start for the Los Angeles Rams. Meanwhile, I, I don't know what the hell the Packers are playing for. What are the, either of these teams playing for other than pride at this point? I don't really care about this game. Is, is it Baker Magic again? No. Is, is that what we're looking at? Okay. No. I. It's adorable. It's very nice. And normally with the way that I like to bet on these guys at first, blah, 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 blah. blah. No. The Green Bay is winning this game at home. Um, they are covering this spread. I'm not really worried about the Rams in the situation. And like, what, it, what are the Rams? What are you fighting for here, guys? Like, I don't know what that, like, there's a, if you like squint your eyes, like Green Bay, like there's some kind of like really small glimmer of hope. Like, the Rams do not have a glimmer of hope. There is no hope. There's actually nothing hopeful looking forward for the next couple of years. Um, I like Green Bay. Probably a nice night to put another uh, bet on Christian Watson to get two touchdowns. This this Rams defense has just not been impressive. Um, I think, you know, yeah. The, but the Raiders, you, you look at last week, like, the Raiders gave them that game. It's like, yeah. it's, uh, so I can't, I can't count on the Rams to beat Green Bay. I wish that I was more confident in the under in this game. I actually am still might bet at 39 and a half. I still kind of like the under in this game. The Rams, Baker, they're not going to get anything, dude. Like, he was the ultimate science experiment. A guy came in in two days. They had no idea what he was going to do. He comes out. He wins the game. Now you have time to prepare for him in this offense. I think the Packers absolutely smashed. That's You're adrenaline. Right. Um, that's yeah. adrenaline took an Adderall. Like, that is all that was. That was not, like, Baker's, like, giving himself a concussion after. Like, it was awesome to see. And I, like, wish Baker the best. But we've seen how this goes. Like, it's not – I mean, the cards are not in his favor. Yeah, absolutely. I, I think the best way to play this game, at least to me, is going to be to grab the Packers right now at minus seven and bring it down to minus one yeah. in a teaser. Um, like pair it with – there's – there's a lot of other options on the board for you to use. Tennessee at plus nine is probably a great one. The Raiders plus one to plus eight is also a great one. Um, I also like the Jets if you can get them at uh, plus one somewhere, moving them to plus seven. So there's a lot of options out there for you, but make sure to pair it with the Packers and at least one of them because I think that is yeah. probably a really nice bet. And also, you know, I hate using – I hate doing parlays where the last team, I have to wait until Monday night. I'd rather get it all synced yeah. up on a Sunday. Yeah. But Packers minus 295 is the last leg if you're going to do an open-ended parlay. Mm -hmm. I've heard worse ideas. Yeah, absolutely. Totally agree.